Today is the second day down in Algarve and today the plan is to go to the Seven Hanging Valleys trail. So we're going hiking and apparently this is one of the most beautiful trail in Europe and in the world in general. So I'm really excited about this. Yeah, we'll see how it lives up to the expectations and yeah, along the way we're going to swim a little bit and etc. And that's why I have my swimsuit on as well. I quickly want to show you my outfit because it's really cute. So today I'm wearing this all yellow set. It's pastel yellow, so I have this little backless tank top. And then I have these shorts that I got from Primark. They are kind of towel material like, which I really love. And I feel like since we're going to get on and off of the beach um, it's a really nice material to have and then I'm wearing my hair max they're really broken in and they have holes in them because they are a little bit too big for me and so my toe keeps going up and that's why I have holes and all my outfit matches my nails which I really like Also today I woke up with a really really bad neck pain so hopefully that will be an issue while hiking but yeah for now it's okay you can see the sea here Step back from so we just arrived at Praia de Marinha and <laughs> parked our car somewhere here and as you can see it's very cloudy i'm actually quite cold so i'm taking this button up shirt as a cover-up and now we're going to see if there's a cafe um, in which we can eat some breakfast because we need to have our stomach full for hiking The clouds here are very black. I just hope it's not gonna rain. But since it's a linear walk, um, we just hope to have like the sun on our way back so that we can take some nice pictures. This might be the Benagio cave, but I'm not really sure if it is this one. I think this is Benagio beach. So from here to the caves, it's like 10 minute kayaks and if you depart from 
Marina Beach. It's 35 minutes of kayak, according to my research. So we just stopped at a coffee that's right above the Benajo beach. And we are back on track with beautiful views. We're going to have a little stop at this beach. I'm not sure which beach this is but this is the one just after the Benadryl one we just want to see how the water is if it's cold or not and then we'll keep on with the trail So that's the beach where we were, the water was freezing cold but it's really cool because you enter from this string out here so you go from here to here down. I think we are finally seeing the end of this trail. I'm starting to get very hot and tired and I have like a headache because of my neck problem. I think this is the end. So this beach, I'm not sure the name of it, but yeah. And we need to buy some drinks because they don't have any fountains and stuff like that, nor any shop um, in between other than the Benagio. And so now we really need some water. So we just stopped at this restaurant and we're going to eat uh, lunch. It's almost 2 p.m. and the view is really nice. I had a drink and I feel a lot better now. So I got a nice tea and this is the view. So we just finished eating, it was really nice, especially my salad was huge, so I'm really full. We wanted to swim in the beach here, but since we're full, we're just gonna walk back towards where we parked our car, and then we're probably going to swim there. So it's still very hot right now. So for one way, we took about four hours, and that's like us taking a ton of time to to stop and take pictures and stuff like that. So yeah, I think this hike is something that you have to allow a lot of time to it, just because you have to enjoy the views. They are very breathtaking. And I just wanted to show you guys that sky is like no clouds at all compared to this morning. So that's crazy and that's really nice. I'm not gonna film too much on our way back since it's the same path. I'll see you guys when we we are at the beach. We are back at our starting point. It's 5 p.m. so it took us uh, seven hours to go one way and then eat lunch and then come back. So now we're just going to get our beach towel so that we can stay a moment at 
um, our starting point, which is the Marina Beach. There's a lot of people but it's not even overcrowded. It's like 5 p.m. and most people are leaving and we just arrived. It's a great time to come here. But the water is really really cold as always. We are now in the old town of Albufeira and we're just going to walk around and eat dinner there and it's almost 7 p.m now when we were in the car i saw a street that looked very busy so we're gonna see like what they have there and yeah hopefully we can find a good restaurant as well guys today is the next day and I just quickly want to end the vlog here because I forgot yesterday because I was really tired and so we just went back home at around 10 p.m. I just wanted to wrap up on the hiking part it's definitely not an easy walk nor a difficult hike um, what really made it difficult was definitely the Sun which was hitting very hard on us after that the sky cleared out and so I would highly recommend you don't forget your hat and a lot of water because we couldn't buy water um, between Benagil and the end so that's something to be very careful of and another thing I want to recommend you is to wear some really good sneakers because it's a very rocky part you'll have to climb a few rocks and stuff like that so bring your sneakers but also keep maybe a pair of flip flops either in your car or in your backpack if you can and yeah i think that's it for this vlog i'm gonna end it here i hope you guys liked it and i'll see you in the next one bye guys <laughs> <laughs>